Hello friends how are you guys i welcome you to my youtube channel here we will know about the great rulers of our past today we are going to see about the great king prithu he belonged to kamrup dynasty kamrup dynasty was established during 4th century ce in the eastern part of bharat Raja Prithu was the notable ruler of this dynasty. He played very important role in defending the nation under the attack of Bakhtiyar Khilji. Bakhtiyar Khilji was a commander of Qutbuddin Aibak. Bakhtiyar Khilji attacked the very famous Nalanda University and killed innocent Buddhist monks and Hindu Brahmin priests in thousands. He also attacked the Takshashila and Odantipuri University. He set fire to the Nalanda University. It is said that Nalanda University was so vast that it took three complete months to destroy it. Also, the smoke was continuously coming out of it for six months. More than ninety lakh books were burnt. Astronomy, science, warfare, literature, architecture, medicine. Ayurveda and many more was taught in the Nalanda University and the shameless britishers later claimed that they taught us everything how funny and we indians even believed it being unaware of our glorious past in the year 1206 bakhtiyar khilji with an army of 12000 soldiers passed through assam to attack the tibet region during that time Assam region was under the control of King Prithu of Kamrup dynasty. King Prithu intentionally let Bakhtiyar Khilji pass through his region without offering any disturbance. Later, when Bakhtiyar Khilji's army was passed through his region, Raja Prithu adopted a scorched earth policy due to which 6000 soldiers of Bakhtiyar Khilji were dead. Scorched earth policy is a military strategy of burning or destroying crops or other resources in a particular area that the army might use. Bakhtiyar Khilji was shocked to see a huge army already waiting for him in Tibet. He decided to come back from Tibet while returning through the Kamrup region. Bakhtiyar Khilji's army found no food resources available, no shelter, etc. A huge bridge that the army used to cross the river was also found to be broken guys i have read that once when bakhtiyar khilji fell sick he even refused to get treated by hindu ayurveda acharya but just look at him now he took shelter at a temple nearby king prithu launched a surprise attack and destroyed the army of bakhtiyar khilji many of them even surrendered In this battle Bakhtiyar along with a few men somehow escaped after this worst defeat Bakhtiyar Khilji never led any campaign this event not only said about the braveness of king prithu it also narrated the war technique which was used by russia to drive out german army out of the region we the people of bharat must be proud that we are the pioneer of this war technique we have to give our salute to our great rulers who sacrificed their life to protect our nation from the barbarian invaders do tell me guys if you were already aware of king prithu if yes then how because i have not studied about these great rulers in our history books at least do share these stories with your friends guys if you are a student tell these to your parents and if you are a parent then it is your responsibility to tell these great stories to your children now being aware of raja prithu it is your duty to share it with your friends thank you so much for watching the video guys thank you